Hi guys, what's up? It's Liz here. So, this is my face routine slash um, hair care thing. But um, for the hair care, I'm not going to show the products. I'm going to talk about the products, but I will be doing a blog about it, posting the pictures. So, except I won't be doing like a blog blog, you know, typing it all out. I'll just post the video on my blog that I'm making right now and they can go back and look at the pictures about what I'm talking about because I don't feel like pausing the video, making another video, going to the bathroom and the stuff is really wet right now and it looks disgusting. So let's get on to business or as Breelin Greater Clitter 17 or 18, I don't know, I keep forgetting what the last number is. Um, like Breelin says, let's get started. So, the first thing is that, um, oh, speaking of which, I have to make a tribute video. Okay, so, first things first, this is a very simple, um, routine. So, basically, every day, Monday through Fridays, I wake up, as you normally do, I eat breakfast, I catch up on shows. This is my schedule, and there's probably going to be another part, maybe. So this is my schedule. Mondays, I I watch a Gilmore Girls, and sometimes Jamie Oliver's 30 Cooking Meal, the Majiggy, and yeah, okay. Mondays are usually I don't really catch up on... Oh, no, I forgot. Duh, The Killing and Madman. So Mondays I catch up on Killing and Madman because I have Corey on Sundays. And then Tuesdays I watch um, Secret Life. And yeah, just Secret Life because Gossip Girl's over already. And um, Wednesdays I watch Glee and New Girl. Um, where was I? Thursdays, I watch Revenge, which is awesome. And then Fridays, I I don't watch anything because everything's a repeat. And then Saturdays, I watch Fairly Legal and Suits. And don't forget, Suits premieres in June, which I'm so freaking excited about. Okay, on to the good part. So, after I catch up on my shows, eat some lunch, all that stuff... I take a shower. So this is my routine. All I use in the shower, day and night, is this clean and clear deep action cream cleanser oil free. So basically, it says, clean and clear deep action cream cleanser removes dirt, oil, even makeup without drying your skin. It reaches deep all the way to your pores to keep your skin clean. After washing, your skin will feel cool and refreshing with the tingling feeling of really clean skin. This stuff is freaking amazing! <laughs> Sorry about that. This stuff has, ac has helped my acne so much and I have used up about three bottles of this which I bought at Aurora Pharmacy for about six bucks. I love this stuff. Except one thing I don't Except there's one little thing I don't like about this. Uh, sometimes it doesn't wash off all my makeup. That's the one thing I don't like about this. But this is a freaking great cleanser. And apparently it's wet. So I'll be right back. back because I spilled all that gloop on me. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so then after that, I use a toner, as you normally should, which is another Clean and Clear Deep X Astergent. This stuff is amazing too. Cleans up all my makeup, yada, yada, yada. And then another product that I got a couple weeks ago was the Olay Complete UV Moisturizer SPF 15 with Sensitive Skin. 
This stuff is truly amazing. It works wonders for my skin. Um, I basically use this at morning or night. I like it better at night because when I wake up, my face is just like, oh, it's amazing. It looks so clean and fresh. I feel like I don't even have to wash my face. <laughs> yeah, this stuff is truly amazing. Um, one thing that I got nervous about when I first got this was, uh-oh, what if it's one of those, like, things where you have to, like, scoop your finger? It's not! Um, it's a squeeze-out. Yay! <laughs> yeah, it's a squeeze-out. I love squeeze-out stuff. It's amazing. Yeah, this stuff, it, um... I use this as my moisturizer. I put so much heavy makeup and it doesn't ruin. This stuff works miracles for using my makeup. That's why I don't have any. Well, I do have a little bit of dry skin, but it's not that bad. Because whenever I use to wear powders, my face will get so freaking dried out. But this stuff helps literally. Or literally. So yeah, this is, I give this a 10 out of 10 out of 10. So I use this this morning and night and I use it after my toner. And yeah, so I'm, I love this stuff. This stuff is amazing. It is A-M-A-Z-I-N-G amazing, y'all. Do it. Okay, so moving on to hair care stuff. I don't have the products with me. They're in my bathroom. Okay, so there are probably like dozens of videos on YouTube talking about the Aussie and the Garnier stuff. There's probably like 5,000 trillion billion videos about that. I need to make my videos more fun. That's why I'm screaming and shouting. But I don't want to scare you guys. Okay, so um, basically... I have been loving the Aussie hair care line. I use the moist shampoo. I use up about three bottles of the shampoo, uh, two bottles of their conditioner, two bottles of um, their three minute miracle mask. Okay, so first things first. I love the shampoo. It lathers, it lathers up and it's very easy to work with and it smells really good. Conditioner, I have like a love and hate. I do like the conditioner, but I hate that feeling when I like put it in my hair. It's like, ugh, you know, you like cringe. I always get like that. But um, I've been using the conditioner more than the three minute mask because they said it's not good to wear the mask. So I use the three minute mask um, like once or twice a week. Okay, I love the three minute mask. It is amazing. It makes my hair like manageable and silky and so vibrant. It makes my hair shiny and beautiful. And it's so soft and it's so fun to play with. And it's very easy for me to comb in my hair to well, brush my hair. Because when I was growing up, my hair used to be very like, eh. And then, um, yeah, so I love that. It's amazing, and it smells really good. Except one thing I don't like about it is the waiting process. You have to wait, like, three minutes. I actually wait about two minutes, and you have to wash it out with hot and cold. And then sometimes, if I feel like it, I use the Mega Shine hairspray. I think it's the Mega, the Mega Shine hairspray. But when you spritz that on, my, I mean when I spritz that on, my hair gets like so like soft and manageable. I look so pretty. I look like a prom queen. It's amazing. Okay, so this is a cons. I don't like the, and another thing I really like about the Aussie Hair Care line, um, I don't use I don't use the gels and creams. I only use the hairspray. The hairspray is amazing. I got it at Aurora Pharmacy. Um, one thing I don't like about the Garnier Fructis Pure Clean Two in One is that it makes the next day it makes my hair like so frizzy and dried out. I don't like it at all. I hate Two in One stuff. It just 
doesn't work with me, but I only use that when I'm in a hurry. Because, you know, when you're in a hurry, you have to, like, shampoo, and then you have the conditioner, and they have to do all that other stuff. You know, like, rinse your body, wash your face, blah, 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 blah. So I only use a Garnier Fructis when I'm in a hurry. Um, I usually use a Garnier Fructis stuff, the Pure Clean 2-in-1. Um, I use it, um, it's a shampoo conditioner together. Um, I usually just use that once or twice a week. I'm, I use it today, and I hate it. But it was all I have because I'm running out of my Aussie shampoo. And you got another one tomorrow. So yeah, that's basically it. I hope I didn't scare you guys. I hope you like this review. And I'm going to make a video for Glitter Critter. Bye!